Superlatives are the name of the game here at the McLaren display at the 2014 Geneva Motor Show. Their alluring 650S parked behind me is supposedly the fastest, most engaging and best equipped production supercar the company has ever built. Now, is that a bunch of bull roar or is it actually the truth? Well, let's find out. First, this car looks positively delicious in that rich blue paint. It's hard not to run up and lick the body even just to get a little taste. Now, as you can see, its design was clearly inspired by the amazing McLaren P1 with lots of swoops and curves. It's also got LED headlamps and a special front splitter that increases downforce for better high-speed handling. And you've got to love those dihedral doors that open upward and outward. Now, the 650S gets its name from the engine that powers it. Under its hood is a mid-mounted 3.8-liter twin-turbocharged V8 that puts out 650 PS, which is sort of the metric equivalent of horsepower. In numbers you may be more familiar with, that works out to around about 641 brake horsepower. Now, the S that follows the 650 stands for Sport. Power is routed to the rear wheels through a seven-speed dual-clutch transmission. Now, thanks to all of that high-tech engineering, this monster can hit 60 miles an hour from a standstill in just three seconds. Top speed is 207 miles an hour. With a machine of this caliber, aerodynamics is critical, and the 650S slices through the wind like a bullet fired from a high-powered rifle. An active air brake, similar to the one on McLaren's 12C, optimizes downforce and, of course, improves stability. The car can actually sense when it needs that extra pressure, and the flap pops up to oblige. The car is also equipped with McLaren's Proactive Chassis Control, PCC for short. This adaptive suspension system adjusts how the car rides and handles. Drivers have three different settings to choose from, normal, sport, and track. Now, PCC also recalibrates the powertrain, though the two can be adjusted independently of one another for total control over how the car behaves. You don't need me to tell you the McLaren 650S is an awesome machine. I mean, you can see it for yourself right here. Now, this car will go on sale in the springtime as both a coupe as well as a spider model. Pricing has not been made public at this juncture, though I can tell you this much. It's going to cost a shit ton, and it's probably going to run like a clap of thunder.